Yo, what is going on everybody? This is EJP3Games and welcome to episode number 9 of the Pokemon Red and Blue Randomized Nuzlocke versus with my dude Jetpack Ahoy. How you doing today, man? I am fantastic. I'm just, you know, sitting here hanging out doing the Pokemon thing with my boy. Doing that Pokemon thing. Always doing that Pokemon thing. Yeah. Was it, was it li live, eat, eat, breathe? Breathe, sleep, something, Pokemon. I don't know. Yeah, man, all that. Eat, uh, yeah. sleep, pray, love, breathe, <laughs> hop, skip, and a jump later <clears throat> through <throat> the woods to Grandma's house. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, as you guys can see, I am still in Mount Moon. Jet, I don't know where you are because I can't see a screen. I'm making my way to Bill's house. Oh, going to Bill's house. Going, going to see Bill's lighthouse. I'm going to check out my buddy Bill. All right, but I am uh, ready to go whenever. This is, this is my team, two Pokemans. All right, I'm ready. I got a full squad, so let's get <laughs> it going. Three, two, one, a go. So if you guys missed the last hey, episode, uh, make sure you guys go check the link out down in the description below. Make sure you guys go follow Jetpack over on Twitter. Make sure you go follow me on Twitter, too. Yeah, I post cool stuff. Yeah, I, I mean, I don't. <laughs> well, don't say that, because I was going to tell them that the cool stuff I tweet is just retweets of your stuff. I mean, I, so now, I, they, now they know that my stuff's not cool. I mean, I, I get on Twitter, I respond to a lot of people. <laughs> <clears throat> and I always post videos, so, like, YouTube is kind of glitchy sometimes, doesn't put stuff out to the sub boxes. So, if you want to watch the series, you know, or we, whenever I go live, or just different things like that. Or just when he accidentally goes live and doesn't realize it. And... Yeah, that happens sometimes too. <laughs> I've done that a time or two. I'm just waiting for the day that your puppy jumps up there and hits the go live button, <laughs> and then it's just a, it's just a puppy in a chair, and it's the most adorable thing ever, and you get ten thousand viewers. Be the most viewers I ever had. <laughs> <laughs> and the puppy won't know what's going on. Yeah, he'll just be chilling. It's like a. IR IRL chair stream, except for just a puppy. Yeah, and it's, it's a puppy, and it's it's just chipping a chair. Pretty and much. Then you get banned for TOS because the dog licks himself. <clears throat> or because I didn't <laughs> categorize it right. <laughs> this is not Pokemon Sun and Moon. What are you talking about? I'm reporting you. Yeah, so I, I was literally streaming. I decided I was going to stream uh, Phoenix Rising. Uh, it was last weekend. And... I got on Twitch, I was literally in there for 30 seconds, I went to Streamlabs, OBS, I hit start streaming, and I think I had it set to Pokemon Sun and Moon Shiny Hunting <clears throat> previously. Like, within like two seconds, someone hops in my chat and was like, you're not streaming Pokemon Ultra Sun and Moon, you need to change the name, it violates Twitch's, you know, terms of service, I'm gonna report you. And I'm like, god damn, okay. <laughs> Calm like, your shit. <clears throat> I'm like... Uh, I just left it uncategorized because there wasn't a category for just like regular Pokemon or yeah. just Phoenix Rising. So I was like, you know what? I may just uh, stream on YouTube next time. <laughs> All right. Oh, I should not have used Fire Spin on this Snorlax. This is going to take eight years. That special defense. Yeah, Snorlax is a fat boy. The chubby, chubby boy with the meanest of underbites. Mmm. Oh yeah, he definitely needs to go see a dentist. Oof. That crit pack destroyed him, though. I am uh, making my way through Mount Moon. Should yeah. let's see, I'm not even gonna bother. Come here and battle me with your with that. Look at that widow's peak. Oh my goodness. My goodness, this sprite doesn't have a forehead. He's got a five head. TM14. What is that gonna be? Sand attack. Barrier. Close enough. Not bad. That could, that could come in handy, maybe. Can it? I, I mean, possibly. Give it to your slowpoke. <clears throat> yeah, I taught it uh, hypnosis. He's not going to have any uh, offensive moves. It's just going to be no. pure utility. Yeah, I mean, at this point, like slowpoke's not even getting trained, so he'll probably get kicked off the team if we <laughs> get some better team members. He's uh, he's just there for, for death fodder at the moment. Basically. <coughs> Bless you. 
Bless you again. Oh, man. I think I sneezed at the beginning of the last episode, too. You did. You were expelling the demons, as you say. Yeah, they're still there. They just come back between episodes. You're not sneezing hard enough. Yeah, sneeze. You got to sneeze harder. <laughs> I know for some reason, like, I don't do it now, but whenever I use um, face cam, like when I use camera to record, mm. like for, I don't know why I sent out a victory bell against a uh, Pidgeot, but. You know, science. I sent a TM for constrict. But anyways, my point was, like, when I'm recording, um, face cam I for some reason I tend like I look at it and I tend to yawn and I don't know why <laughs> like at one point during one of my crystal episodes I was like literally like I need a yawn counter up in the like right hand corner yo what if you get caught in like an infinite loop of yawning because you know like you when you're around somebody else who yawns you yeah. yawn so what if like you yawn but you're looking at your face cam and that person's yawning so you keep yawning and it's just an infinite loop of yawns is that a yeah. possibility you think I uh, maybe I mean, I'm sure like, at some uh, point you would stop yawning. But would you? I don't know. I might just die. I think that there's a name for this effect, because it's the same thing as, like, the infinite, um, like, with mirrors. It's an infinite reflection effect. There's a, there's a name for that. Hang on. I gotta do some Google Foo. Google Foo. I know uh, that there's a what? scientific name for that. My, uh, weeping bell and poison infinite powder. Reflection. Let's see what this, what uh, hidden item is. Ooh, it's a max potion. I might... I might sell that max potion uh, to no. buy uh, regular, appropriate size potions. Where is it? Drost the Drost effect. Yes. It's interesting. I, I knew that was that. a thing. I knew that was a thing. Like I understand the effect, but I didn't know that's what it was called. <laughs> yeah, you know how I know that's what it's called? Because you googled it. Well, no, but I knew I knew that that was a thing. Like there was a there's a name for it. I only knew oh. it because um, I was watching The Flash, and he used mm -hmm. that to beat a guy who disappears into mirrors. Oh, that's right. I do remember yeah. that episode. Uh, season four, of The Flash, just came out on Netflix the other day. I know. I'm so. I'm like halfway through season three, so no spoilers. Oh, no yeah, spoilers. You're, you're in for it. <laughs> Yeah, I am. Yeah, uh, I'll I'm probably watch season four tomorrow, to be honest. Yeah, uh, I'm excited. I'm glad that it came out because I was I'm getting towards the end, you know. Yeah. We uh, just uh, I just finished the second season of Thirteen Reasons Why. That. It's, I haven't watched any of that show. It, it 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 hits you hard. It it hits you with some real life stuff. Yeah, I mean that kind of thing is really difficult for me. I had a friend. Um, it's been two years now. Yeah, uh, he, he passed away uh, due to suicide, and that kind of stuff. It's very difficult for me to like. I don't know if I could actually sit down and watch that show. Yeah, you know? and it's actually got like trigger warnings and stuff. Yeah. So if something's gonna happen, uh, like but, uh, uh, I've lost pretty... multiple friends. Well, not like they've been friends, um, but they weren't like yeah. super close friends to suicide. I've lost classmates. I, I've had family members as well. And I don't know if it's just due to the nature of my life being super thick skin that that stuff doesn't bother me, or what. There's the, uh, like I I'm, I like to think of myself as a pretty thick skinned person. Like I don't get offended easily. I I can take a joke. Like I deal with I just don't deal with death well, man. Yeah. It, that's that's a tough spot for me. And I've actually been considering like really heavily um, doing like a charity stream for for suicide prevention. Yeah, I I definitely want to. Like once I know. Like, I'm, I'm a little more prominent, and I can bring in people to uh, watch and stuff. I, I would love to do a charity stream. Yeah. Um, I'd like to get to a point in my life where, like, I'm able to do at least some sort of uh, a donation matching. You know what I mean? Like, uh, for every whatever amount made, I'll, do I'll donate some amount. You know what I mean? Because yeah. I want to be able to help out, too. And um, that's something that, that's very important. So. That may be something I do, maybe like once uh, once I hit like a thousand Twitch followers or, you know, a thousand YouTube subscribers, I'll do something like yeah. that. I think that would be interesting. There you go, guys. That's your goal. That's your that's your job for, for the day. You know, tell yeah. everybody you know to come subscribe to the JP3 game so that we can yeah. get this, this, charity screen, this charity stream happening. Yeah. Sh and share the channel, you know. 
go, yep. go write write it down on the chalkboard in your classes. You know, put put out flyers, whatever whatever you need to do. And you know, I'll, I'll even I'll even put this out there. If you get DJP three games, either uh, you get them up to a thousand subscribers, um, then I'll jump into the stream. We'll do a, a doubles stream. We'll do a, it'll be like a tandem thing. I can dig it. So, because it's for it's for a very important cause, and yeah, I think that would be amazing. All right. All right. So I just finished the. the we're gonna, we're gonna switch gears back to the Pokemans here. Yeah, back to um, Pokemon after after we went off on a little tangent there. Yeah, uh, I just finished a Bill's house. I'm heading back to Cerulean. I'm gonna fight Misty. I ooh, there's Charmanders in Mount Moon. Why couldn't I get one of those? <laughs> this game is bullshit. <laughs> this game is trash. I'm done. I just keep. Ooh, I found a Fire Stone. <laughs> I need a Leaf Stone nice. though. You have a Leaf Stone in your PC, don't you? Do I? I might. Uh, that may have been... Actually, you know what? That may have been before we restarted. It could have been. I don't remember. I don't remember either. Oh, this guy has a Raichu. This is dangerous. Oh, this 90. Let's just use Roar. I am almost out of Mount Moon. Oh, this Thundershock's gonna hurt. Please don't die. Okay, didn't do that much. Okay, thank God we're such a high level. You know, I said I wanted to have... I at the, Was it last episode I said whenever I get out of Mount Moon, I want to have my two Pokemon level 17, and I'm about to have all four at level 17. There you go. Look so, at you keeping your promises. I, I'm, I'm delivering out here. <laughs> He's a man of his word. <laughs> you signed for the package, I got your delivery. <laughs> it said three to five business days delivery. Guess what? I'm here on day four. What up? I, I mean, I was gonna say day <laughs> two, but <laughs> no, no, no. You're just delivering exactly what you promised. <laughs> no, I low key though. I love that. Like whenever you, uh, you go to order something and it's like, oh yeah, four to seven business days, and you get it in like two days, and I'm like, yo, yeah. this is the best thing <laughs> ever. That's, then, that's literally the best feeling in the world. But then when you have like Amazon Prime and it doesn't come in two days, you're like, yo, this is ridiculous. You just I'm get... about to complain. Like, I'm going to write a stern <laughs> letter to corporate. I'm about to write the angriest of emails. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I'm going to call and the first words out of my mouth are, let me talk to your supervisor. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, no, I feel that though. Like I've had Amazon Prime deliveries get delayed, and I'm just like, what is this bullshit? Right. What am I paying for? Yo. Fuck yes. I thought my my girlfriend has Amazon no! Prime. What happened? So I beat the Rocket Grunt, right? Mhm. Mm and he normally gives you the TM for Dig, yeah. Yeah. Well, the TM he gave me was for Ice Beam. Ooh. But Cloyster can't learn it, because Cloyster can't learn Dig. That is unfortunate. <sighs> Someone can learn Dig, though, I'm sure. Nope. Well, the good thing is you should be able to get a... Uh, is that a route... Is that route 5? Encounter? Oh, my goodness. <clears throat> Did you get yeah. an encounter before uh, Cerulean City? Yes. Okay. I wasn't sure. So I can get one there. Actually, I'm going to deposit this Ice Beam TM into the PC. Yo, this is level 16 polyrath. That's kind of scary. <laughs> I'm going to deposit this Moonstone and this Helix Fossil as well. Because Gen 1, the bag fills up hella quick. Yeah, that's what I'm going to have to do once I get to uh, Cerulean. But that Vine Whip is powerful, though. We got the crit. I'm gonna go put this beat down on Misty right quick. I mean, Cloyster already has Aurora Beam, so it's not like I'm hurting for an Ice type move. Yeah, I, I'm trying to think like the best way for me to like pick up the pace. I guess I could. I mean, <laughs> and I don't want to avoid trainers is a thing. Yeah. I, I probably There's really have to buy not repels. too much you can do. I mean, unless you happen to pick up a Poke Doll, and then you can just skip all of the whole. Uh, Sylph Tower thing. <laughs> oh, yeah. 
I mean, I'm not, I'm not gonna do that. Yo, but... there's Dragonites in Mount Moon. <laughs> Seen a little bit of everything. I'm just, I'm running away from everything at this point. I'm just trying to get I'm through here, but I keep, I keep running into Pokemon weekend. like every five steps. I actually had pretty good luck. Like, I ran into quite a few Pokemon in Mount Moon, but it wasn't like overwhelming. Yeah, that's where I'm at, and it's just like, it's starting to get annoying. You're getting those Zubat encounter rates. I know. Except for they're all <laughs> Dragonite. Yikes. Good experience. Could you, could you imagine, like, real life, you're walking through a cave and there's just a bunch of Dragonites <laughs> flying around, it's smacking just, you in the it's face? It's just filled with Dragonites. Like, nope. I'm noping right out of here. That's an Aerodactyl. Yo. Hold this Aurora Beam. Just hold this for me for just a <laughs> quick minute. I'm, I'm gonna need you to just hold it right quick. Oh, you dropped it. What are you doing, Aerodactyl? You dropped it. Don't uh, drop that dun dun dun. Hey. Hey, don't drop that dun dun. I remember that. Throwback. That is a throwback. <laughs> Yo, Bellsprout's kind of a... Get a weird sprite. Yeah? Is She's it like, as weird as second gen when it does that weird little body roll thing? Oh, no. Not quite that weird. <laughs> that made me feel very uncomfortable as a child. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what you're doing over there. You got that little, like, Shakira body roll thing happening. Shakira, Shakira. <laughs> I'm about to battle this uh, maniac and then get my fossil. You took... You, you, what, what fossil did you grab? I took the grab? Helix fossil. Took the Helix fossil. I'll probably grab the Dome yeah. fossil. And it's usually what I go with anyways. So I usually go with, the, with the, the Helix fossil, and then I always regret it because for some reason... Helix. So, okay, so Helix. Helix sounds more aggressive than mm -hmm. Dome does, and so that in my mind, I immediately think that it's going to be a Kabutops because it's more aggressive than Omastar is, and then I always end up with an Omanyte. I'm like, fuck, <laughs> <laughs> I fucked Got up. You. And then I remember that Helix is a spiral. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> All right, Misty. Let's Which do would the make thing. sense because the uh, Omanyte has a spiral on its shell. Exactly. Couldn't get that one past me, Game Freak. <laughs> it's a nice try. Alright, Misty. Bring that ass over here, girl. Get waxed. And Mewtwo. Fuck! <laughs> Her name's Donna. Oh, she's got a Hypno. Oh. Uh, that's close. It was a Psychic type. Alright, I am battling the, uh, the Maniac. It's a good He's thing got I've got crabby. Twin Needle. Can I get that Poison, too? Hey girl, can I get that poison? Nope, no poison. Alright. It's dead though. That's good. Do I used That's to hate having to battle Misty Starmie? Alright. Yeah, Misty Starmie was rough. That was like the first gen equivalent to the mil to Whitney's mill tank. It really was. Oh, this guy's got a Krabby <laughs> and a Kingler. Yo, it's. Claws are the same size. That's dumb. Isn't that weird? That's wrong. <laughs> Big That's incorrect. Claws. How was it? <laughs> Is mayonnaise an instrument? <laughs> Is mayonnaise an instrument? Look, I'm gonna sleep out here. That's dope. We're gonna get rid of uh, growth. Ooh, I need to write this down. What is this, episode 9? Yeah? It is episode 9. Ooh, we need to get rid of chugging right along. Let's see. Gary D. Got that Cascade Badge, though. Alright, that didn't do a whole lot. Um, I'm gonna hit it with the Poison Powder, hopefully, and then I'm gonna switch out. All Pokemon up to level 30 will obey. That's good. That is a very good thing. Alright, TM11, please be something good. Please. I always remember I would, like, trade over Pokemon from, bad. like, blue to red and be like, Oh, you got a level 100 Mewtwo to and start <laughs> off the game with. And it's like, oh, it won't obey. And I'm like, what? And, like, I used to just get so frustrated because I didn't know what was going on. <laughs> I'm going to teach Okay, this might not be good. My... This Gyarados just Hydro Pump my Ghastly. Oh, oh yeah. we lived on 7. Yeah, it has Bite, too. But Bite's normal type in this game. Jesus Christ. I think it's normal. I did not know sure this Gyarados type. was going to have... Hydro Pump at level 13. He's got Dragon Rage 2. 
Oh, does he? What? That's gonna kill everything you have. Ah, uh, not quite. I think you I've, have Pokemon I think over I've got, 40 uh, HP. He's poisoned. Yeah. You're just gonna have to heal spam it. Yeah, I'm gonna use a lemonade here. <laughs> Yikes! All right, he used Leer. I'm good. I'm I'm in the clear. Dude, I fought a Gyarados in the last Jesus episode. Christ, and complete, that was scary. I, for some reason, I I didn't think Dragon Rage was in first gen. I yeah. Holy crap! I think Gyarados is maybe the only one that learns it. Or maybe Dratini too. He didn't even use it. He just tried. He used Hydro Pump and missed, and then used Bite, and almost one shotted me with a bite. It was on my Electrode. That was ridiculous. Like I was lucky. I was above fifty HP. Like I switched out. <laughs> yeah. Yikeruni. All right, I got right, my dome fossil. I think there was more items in Pokemon Yellow as well. Yeah. Um. Probably. How much time do we have left? I feel like we're probably. Uh, we've got to... five minutes. Five minutes. We got plenty of time. <laughs> my uh, my encounter. Uh, just south of Cerulean City's a bell sprout. I found TMO four. What's that gonna be? You're right. Its sprite is odd. TMO four is recovered. It's a little aka awkward. I can't learn that at all. I don't know what is usually TMO four. Uh, where'd you find it? Um, um, they like the ledges right above you as you come out of Mount Moon. I want to say it's like Mega Punch or something like that, but well, I could be wrong. Yo, a Dragonair is my encounter. It's at level 12, though. Like, Dragonair's broken in this game, man. Does it, does it have Dragon Rage? Uh, no, it'll have Rap, uh, Leer, and Thunder Wave, I think. Um, I'll probably go ahead and catch it, and then uh, I'll, get, I'll put this Tentacool on the PC. Then I might be able to battle the rival. Depends on how long this encounter takes. Alright, um, I'm gonna switch out to Venus and use. Oh no, powder. I have a spell. Never mind, I got wrapped. See, that's why I kinda wish it was a Dragonite, because it's. I'll have to get a to level 55 to evolve it. Yeah. So it's like, I don't know if it's worth leveling up. I only got four Pokeballs anyways. So I caught the Bell Sprout. I'm going to leave it on my team, too. Yo, I caught the Dragonair. Nice. First ball. Nice. I named my Bell Sprout Brussel. Hmm. I hate Brussel Sprouts. Me too, uh, they're gross. What's they're the name disgusting. of that, uh, that dragon from uh, Mulan? Mushu. Mushu. That's what I'm naming my uh, dragon. Oh, what the fuck? Why did my electrode have to die? This kid wants to trade an electrode for a Vaporeon. Bruh. Oh, that's right. I did. Did you randomize yours like the given and. <sighs> yeah. I'm about to check what mine is. The hell are the odds, man? Is that the one in Cerulean City? That's the one south, like heading towards Vermilion. Oh. Did you check the one in Cerulean City? No. Uh, ditto for a Jolteon. Now I want to go back and check. Might be worth it. It might not be. No, I, I have know. to. Uh, I'm not going to go back right now. I have to go back anyways to get the bicycle. Oh, yeah. So I'll true. just check it then. In the for, in the sake of saving time. Yeah, once you get on that bicycle, right. you'll be uh, you'll be putting some distance between us. Yeah. All right. All right now I'm going to get this encounter. In PC. Let's what see if I do have a. It's least, a nine uh, tails. I do not. It's really cool, but it's not going to learn any moves. Alright, um... Uh, Two minute warning. Deposit TM14. Deposit Firestone. Deposit Dome Fossil. And I'll deposit TM04. And I healed already, right? I did. I'm gonna go buy some potions and stuff, and I'm gonna go take on the rival real quick. Alright. See if I can. Oh, come on, Ninetales. Stay in the ball. Oh, I know what I'll do. Get in your Switch home. out to Moltres. Are you too good for your home? Just tap. 
it in. I Just love happy tappa, gamer. Tappa tappa tappa. I love all like the like the late '90s, early 2000s uh, Adam Sandler movies. <laughs> you know, like Billy Madison, Waterboy, Happy Gilmore. <laughs> yeah, you can't beat them. No, they're amazing. All right, I'm buying 20 potions. All right, caught the Nine Tails. I'm gonna go full like anime weeb nerd and name it QB. Hmm. I don't know what that's from, so. It's from Naruto. It's the okay. nine-tailed fox. I have not Naruto. Naruto is one of those things I haven't watched yet. I actually really like Naruto. I, feel I thought it was a great show, personally. Um, I'm gonna do. Oh, we got thirty seconds. All right, about to get I'm, gonna into go, a I'm, gonna, I'm gonna go get in this rival battle real quick. <laughs> doing it. <laughs> Stretch it. <laughs> All right, I'm here. <laughs> Still struggling on back here. I'm doing great. I caught a bunch of strong and smart Pokemon. <laughs> back. <laughs> All right. Yeah, whatever, Clem. bro. All right, he's got a Kingler to start off with. That's fine. Level 18. An incorrect Kingler. There's a the timer. There's so the after time. these battles, we're Dunsky. We are. I sh should be able to make minced meat. Of this, uh... Oh, I thought he thought he just said he had guillotine there for a second. I was like, oh shit! But it, <laughs> oh, it was in, it was indeed vice grip. Yeah, but they have the same animation and it's terrifying. Yeah, but I think that's the same animation as Clamp as well, to be honest. Yeah, it's just a straight line like coming through, which is yep. All right, I'm out of my battle and saving my game. All right, I think I still have three more Pokemon to battle yet. Yeah, he's got a total of four. Venus grows level 19. Uh, he's got a Geodude. Stay out. Geodude. And with that Vine Whip. Yo, do you think kids in the Pokemon world use Geodudes as rock fights? Oh, I'm sure they do. And an Ammonite. He's just got everything I can slaughter with the grass type. <laughs> I do you think they just pick up Geodudes and huck them at each other? That's what I would do. I mean, is that animal cruelty at that point? Ah. Like, could you be arrested for that? Probably. Hmm. I mean, it kind of makes you wonder, like... Because, I mean, they show, like, in the anime that, like, they went to, like, some sushi place or whatever, and they had, like, chopped up Magikarp. Oh, yeah. So I was like, do they have, like, normal fish as well? Like, or do they literally... Like, are there normal animals? Like, are there cows for beef? Or are they eating Miltanks and Tauros? Like... What happens? <laughs> I don't know. Because they never show any other animals. All I know is when I, mean, I die, I hope I just go to a land of Pokemon. Yeah, that'd be cool. Like that, that is my heaven. <laughs> Alright. These are answer these are questions I need answers for. I have defeated the rival. Alright. We were both just cruising along here. Right? We're past all that, all the nervousness that made us lose our games at the beginning of the series. Was it, was, uh, third, third time's a charm? Third time's a charm. <laughs> all right. But that is going to do it for today's episode. Um, any final words? Uh, yeah, well, actually, um, I'm just going to kind of touch back on what we talked on earlier a little bit. I um, just kind of want to end with, you know, obviously suicide is in no way or shape or form a joke of any kind not to be taken lightly. Um, if you or anybody you know uh, has thoughts of suicide, uh, they're depressed, and they just need somebody to talk to, reach out to somebody. Um, there's phone numbers, there are websites, and hell, talk to me. I'm here. Yeah, so. I am going to say definitely even reach out to us because um, I have no problem losing sleep to keep someone from doing something they will ultimately regret exactly so but but yeah we're gonna end it off with that everybody take care of yourselves i love you guys and we will see you guys next time peace bye